Austin, what are we going to do today? Um, blossoms. Yeah, we're going to paint cool blossoms, huh? Yeah. Because it's springtime. Yeah. Yeah. Friends, we got a really cool activity today, don't we, Austin? Yeah. Yes, it's gonna be super awesome. Yes. We're gonna do some blossoms because what? It's spring, right? Yeah. How old are you? Three. Yes. And so this is a fun activity for young, young artists, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So should we show them all the stuff that we got? Yeah. All right. So we got some watercolor paper. Yeah. You don't really need this kind of paper, but it works really well with paints because it's it's tougher. Okay. Yeah. It's thicker. And then we also got some paint brushes. This is a nice set that we found on Amazon. We'll leave a link to this where our parents can, can buy these, okay? okay? And we got a bunch of paint, huh? Yeah. What kind of paint do we have? Red. Yes, red. Um, white. White. Black. Yeah, I'm black. And then this, this is acrylic paint, but you can really use any paint that you want. Okay. And then we have a jar full of water. Mm -hmm. And then we've got these trays that we have some paint in, huh? Yes, and we're gonna first start off with the black, yeah. and we mixed it with some white. We're using a, or we mixed it with some water, yeah. and so it will be more runny, because we're gonna blow the paint okay. all over our paper. Is that yeah. cool? Yeah. <laughs> so it might get a little messy. You want to make sure that you you're not gonna get anything ruined or get any paint on it. Yeah. Yeah. And we're ready. Yeah. Should we do this? Yeah. Okay. Let's get our stuff all ready. All right. So first step, we're gonna tape our paper down to the table so it doesn't blow away. Yeah. Okay. So we're gonna just take a little piece of tape and put it down at the very bottom, okay. and we can press down. One sec. There. I'll get it lined up. Okay. Press it down. Good job. And we don't want to stick the tape all the way on the paper because we don't want it to rip it when we pull it up. Okay. But we'll stick it down and just put a little edge on there. All right, our paper's stuck down, huh? Yeah. We ready for the next step? Yeah. <laughs> okay, we're gonna move this this tray off to the side because we don't need it right away. And we'll move some of these other paints off to the side. And we're gonna move this water off to the side too because we don't really need it right away, yeah. okay? Yeah. So we're gonna mix water with our black paint. You wanna get your paintbrush? Yeah. Go ahead, it's right here. So we have this big set of paint brushes, but we're not gonna use all of them. It was just something we wanted to show our art friends. We're just gonna use one of the paint brushes out of it. But this is a cool set because it has a bunch of different sizes. Yeah. All right. Okay, Austin, go ahead and mix the, the water with the paint. Okay. All right, Austin, okay, now what we're gonna do, oh, that's okay, you got a little drop on your paper. That's all right. So we're gonna get our paint on our paint brush and we're gonna come down here and we're gonna put a little line like this, okay. right in the middle, you can put it right here in the middle. And you can start where that drop is, that's okay. Okay, yeah. we just put a little line, like a one. Go ahead and draw it all the way down to the bottom, paint it all the way to the bottom. All right, okay, and we can put these paint brushes off to the side. We have some paper towels too. We're gonna set these off to the side. Okay, now we're gonna get our our straw. This is the cool part. Yeah. All right, watch this, Austin. All right, watch me. I'm gonna put the the straw right here at the edge, and we're gonna blow that way. Okay, watch this. <laughs> Go ahead, blow some more. And you know what? I'm gonna help you. We're gonna put more paint on there so you can blow more paint. Okay. Okay, so go ahead and blow that. Yes. <laughs> okay, take a little break. Okay, so you wanna make sure that you take a little break because if you blow too much through the straw, yeah. you might get a little dizzy. Yeah. Yeah? yeah? Should we do some more? Are you ready to do some more? Yeah. All right, here we go. Okay, I'm gonna put another long, I'm gonna put a longer one on here with more paint, okay? We're gonna get a bigger pile okay. of, of uh, paint right here so you can blow it a lot. Okay, there you go. Yes. I'll help you. Yeah, cool. Blow that pile right there. That, yeah, awesome. Okay, I'm gonna do some more too. And we can do another, another branch. Let's do another branch that comes out here. Yeah. I'm gonna do another branch too, okay dude? Okay, take a little break and I'm gonna do mine, okay? <laughs> Go 
Good job, dude. Now this is kind of meant to look like a really cool tree, huh? Does that look awesome? Yeah, it does. Okay, we're all done with the straws. Can we put those down? Let's put those over here. And then we needed the jar of water because we're gonna rinse out our paintbrushes, okay? So we're gonna get all the black off. Okay, little dude, it's all dry. We waited until the black paint dried. And if you want, you can actually use a blow dryer and speed it up a little bit, huh? Yeah. Did we do that? Yeah. That was pretty cool watching it dry, huh? Yeah. yeah so the next part, we're ready to paint, to paint the blossoms. Yeah. And we're going to use red and white. And we have more white in here than we have red. Do you want to mix it, dude? Yeah. Okay, here's your paintbrush. Okay, mix it around. And what color is it going to make? you want to tell me? Yeah. Do you remember what it does when we add white to the color? It makes green. It, no. <laughs> it makes it a little lighter. Uh, Look, the red is lighter and it makes pink, huh? Yeah. Isn't that cool? Yeah. We're going to make pink blossoms on our tree. Yeah. Yeah, just like the ones outside in our yard, huh? Yeah. Yes. All right, here, let me help you. I'm going to mix it up a little bit more. We'll get this really pink, huh? Okay, yeah. one sec. Is that cool? Yeah. We got it all painted. Yeah. Now we're gonna do. I need a little bit you more. want a little more? All right. <laughs> okay, dude. We're ready to do the little flowers. Okay. okay. Watch this. We're gonna do a little spot. We're just gonna do a little dot. Ready? Plop. Plop. Do you Blop. remember that? Plop. <laughs> Plop. 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 <laughs> Plop. And you can do little dots too. You want to do a little dot? Do some little dots in there too. And we're just going to go around and we'll cover the whole thing with blossoms, okay? Yeah. Plop. 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 Good job, dude. You did awesome on your flowers. What are those flowers called again? Blossoms. Yes, blossoms. And they come out in the springtime, huh? Yeah. Just like the trees in our yard. Yeah. Was that a lot of fun? You promise? Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> we hope you guys had a lot of fun painting these blossoms with us. This is a really fun activity to do with young artists. Now one thing you want to just make sure is that you, you get everything protected so you're not worried about the paint. And then you can let them blow the paint all over it wherever you want, huh? Yeah. Yes, wherever you want. Yeah. Yes. Was that fun with the straw? Yeah. Should we do more of it? Yeah. Alright. We'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Bye.